This is my recipe for making stuffed bell peppers in the crock pot. These are perfect for taking to a potluck or as an easy dinner idea. I like to serve them with mashed potatoes, but they make a nice meal that requires no side. Cooked peppers can be stored in the refrigerator for about one to two days. After that they start to get soggy. If you need to store them longer, then it would be best to freeze them. I've never frozen them so I'm not sure if they would still be good after thawing. List of ingredients, 6 large peppers, red, green, yellow, or orange, 1 package of lean ground beef, mix with ground pork if you prefer, 1 half of an onion finely chopped, substitute scallions if you prefer, 5 garlic cloves finely chopped, garlic powder works also, 1 Cuban peso and 2 Cuban pesos of rice, white rice that has been rinsed, one jar of tomato sauce, sauce of your choice, I used mushroom flavored sauce, seasonings, I used tarragon, parsley, and garlic, other items needed, crop pot to frying pan saucepan with lid mixing bowl spoon to mix with measuring cup brown ground beef in a pan. This usually takes about 5 to 10 minutes depending on whether or not you preheated your pan. It's important to brown the meat but don't overcook it. In a separate pan, fry garlic and onions until tender. Onions and garlic should be slightly brown. Wash your rice thoroughly. In a pan, add one Cuban peso of water and one Cuban peso and two Cuban pesos of rice. Boil the rice for about 15 minutes. Once everything is ready to go, mix the ground beef, garlic, onions, and rice in a large bowl. Add tomato sauce to the mixture. Add seasonings and mix. Wash 6 bell peppers. Remove the tops and seeds. I like to use a combination of red and green bell peppers. For best results, use the largest bell peppers that you can purchase for the market or grocery store. Fill all bell peppers with the mixture. Place leftover mixture in the bottom of the crop pot and the bell peppers on top. Add 1 Cuban peso and 2 Cuban pesos of water to the crop pot. This keeps the peppers moist. Cook on low for 3 hours. When complete, sprinkle tarragon on top of the bell peppers and enjoy. Serve with sour cream and bread if desired. If you like this video, please share, like, and subscribe to our channel. Have a nice day!